This hydraulic cylinder right here is supposed to increase the lifting capacity of my Kubota BX23S by 35%. That's a lot. 35%. All right? Stick around. I'll tell you a little bit more about this. For a long time now, I've been wanting to increase the lifting capacity of my loader on my BX Kubota. And we did a test in a video not too long ago about how much weight this could lift. Now, in the book, in the catalog from 2017, Kubota's product catalog, this is a 2017 model, it listed that the lifting capacity was 613 pounds. And I've been saying that's just a dismal number. That's, that's terrible, that's horrible. As you see right here, an absolute dismal 613 pounds. And I didn't think that my tractor could lift a whole lot more than that, but then we tested it. And we found out that it does have a lifting capacity of 880 pounds. But that's where we're at. Right? Now this statistic in the catalog and the way that I did it, were both at the pivot pin. This cylinder from Hydros Plus is supposed to increase the loader lift capacity by 35%. 35% <laughs> greater than 880. Let's do a little calculation, shall we? So 880 plus 35%, well, 35% is 308 more, is going to bring us to 1,188 pounds, which will put us at our goal, right? Because our goal to reach lift capacity is greater than 1,000 pounds. So that is going to happen with this cylinder. And I'm really looking forward to it. And I'm really excited to be working with Hydros Plus on this to kind of promote this cylinder. Because we're gonna be able to increase the lift capacity without increasing the hydraulic pressure. And if you've seen another video where we tested the hydraulic pressure, in fact, I think it was the same video I talked about earlier, the hydraulic pressure of this Kubota, this tractor here, is set at 1,750, maybe. Five, six, so oh high. Barely 1,700. Falls off to at about 1,700, wow. That was only, that was like 1,700, 1,750, maybe. And I think it's pretty safe to increase that hydraulic pressure to 2,000, but we're not gonna do that yet. What we're going to do is we're going to install this hydraulic cylinder onto this tractor and see if we can get past that 1,000 pound mark with just changing out the cylinders. Now I want to bring you in close and I want to show you just a couple differences about this cylinder versus the factory one. Now I'm going to hold these cylinders right up next to each other and you can see that the one in my hands is a lot shinier, right? That's one difference. It's, it's brand new. It's, it hasn't even been used yet. Um, but the other difference is the one that I'm holding has a bigger diameter. It's, it's a bigger cylinder, which means it's going to be a stronger cylinder as well. The one I'm holding has a one and three quarter inch bore. And the one that comes standard with your LA340 loader has a one and a half inch bore. So that quarter inch difference is going to equate to a 35% more lifting capacity. Now I'm going to bring you in a little closer and I'm going to show you another difference that is an added advantage of this Hydro Plus cylinder. Now I'm holding this about even with the factory cylinder. And you're going to notice that the barrel, the outer part of the hydraulic cylinder on the Hydros Plus one, the one I'm holding, is a bit longer than the factory one. There's about two inches more here of space, which gives us an awesome added bonus. So I'm going to talk about that in a second. But uh, because it's a little bit longer and wider, it gives us two huge, huge advantages. So let's talk about that. So not only do you get 35% increase in lift capacity with this cylinder, at least that's what Hydros Plus says, so we're going to test it. I, I think we're going to be very close to that. But the other big advantage of because of the longer barrel of the cylinder, that is also going to give you a greater lift height of up to almost a foot, about 11 and a half inches 
of increased height. That's going to be awesome because there are things that I wish that I could reach that I can't reach with this factory loader. This cylinder is going to increase the height by almost a foot. That is huge. So we're gonna get 35% more lift capacity and we're gonna get almost a foot of lift height. That's awesome. Now, come in here, I'll show you how they did that, right? Come here. Because Kubota did not bring this barrel all the way out, they easily could have. They could have made the barrel of this cylinder a lot longer, but they didn't. Kevin at Hydros Plus saw that. He saw an advantage to be made and he designed this cylinder to be a little bit longer. So not only is it gonna have greater lift capacity, but it's gonna have greater lift height. It's gonna go much higher. It's gonna be great. So I can't wait to test this out. I'd love to do it today. It's raining. It's been raining for a day and a half straight. Oh man, you finally get some time to do stuff and, and get some content recorded and it rains. So we're gonna have to wait for another drier day. I would love to tell you more about this and, and install this and get it going, but uh, that's gonna wait for another day. And I hope it doesn't snow before then because I'm kind of battling the weather here. Uh, but I really do appreciate you guys sticking around and following this. This, this is a beautiful cylinder. This is gonna be fantastic. Thank you, Kevin at Hydros Plus. Guys, I want you to go check out the Hydros Plus YouTube channel. All right, here it is, final answer. In my best judgment based on my vantage point, which is way down here, is 77 and three quarters. A foot more, just directionally, for this tractor is a very big deal. Kevin at Hydros Plus is a hydraulic genius. He can solve many different issues. He has helped Tractor Time with Tim solve a lot of different issues. Uh, and there's, there's so much to talk about there that I'm, I'm not even gonna start. But there's so much. He really does understand hydraulics, hydraulic pressure, hydraulic flow, and anything related to the tractor's lift capacity and, and the engine power and figuring out turbo kits for, yes, turbo kit. A turbo kit for the BX Kubota is what he's working on right now. So if that's, not, if that's not motivation enough to go check out the Hydros Plus YouTube channel, uh, I don't know what is. But yeah, we're going to get the cylinder installed. It's going to be great. Thanks for sticking around. Comment down below. Make sure you like and subscribe and stay tuned. Until next time, keep on tractoring and God bless.